On Wednesday, every dog within 10 miles of Eldon's Fresh Foods was listening in, and probably howling. With hundreds of weenie whistles being handed out and plenty of time in line, kids were just being kids. But this isn't a story about dogs, unless you're talking about hot dogs, specifically the Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. This icon brought out the tongue-in-cheek in everybody. This has been my dream to be near the Wienermobile, let alone this close, or maybe even take a ride in it. And when my son gave me a picture, sent me a picture that he had taken yesterday, I knew I had to come down here and see if Oscar was around or not. And it's better in real life than it is in my head. Can you imagine driving that thing? No. What would it be like? Just describe <laughs> what it would be like driving that. Crazy. How do a lot of people react when they see just a giant hot dog rolling <laughs> through the streets? There's some pretty strong reactions. Um, I think the Wienermobile is one of the only vehicles where if someone honks at you on the road, it's a good thing. <laughs> we get a lot of smiles, a lot of waves, and a lot of people taking pictures. People waited in line for not only photos of the famous Wienermobile, but also to, what else? Take a bite out of an Oscar Mayer Wiener. Part of many free meals given away at Eldon's that day, in very short order. Hi hey girls, how are we doing today? Good, how are you? We are so excited, right? Yeah. Can't wait. Cool. Very cool. It's okay. awesome. We went through a thousand hot dogs already, so they're making some more back there right now. No, in one breath I thought maybe we'd be here till five today, but then at the same time I thought it could maybe just take 30 minutes to go through a thousand hot dogs, and it did. 34 minutes and we were out of hot dogs. So we're making a thousand more right now. Alexandria Choir Director Steve Dietz acted as the hot dog delivery guy, and people were eagerly able to resume getting their favorite hot Thank dog. You. Thank you very much. <laughs> the Wienermobile was in town for only a short time, but it was long enough for hundreds of people to gather in a fun hometown stop and chat atmosphere. Did you like it? Yeah. Yeah. Do you think it's better than the regular hot dog since it came from that big weenie mobile? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> A great celebration, great for the kids in the summer. You know, that's the months of the year we want to enjoy uh, our weather in Minnesota. And uh, of course, I'm here with my three kids and my wife, and uh, they, like many kids, enjoy this kind of event. I just think it brings out a lot of, uh, a f it's a fun nature in this community, and I think we're already very close knit, so when we get together, it's like one big family reunion. There were also the virtual Wienermobile tours, where with some goggles you were transported into the front seat of the 27-foot hot dog as it travels around the country. Yeah, so there was a virtual tour, so kids can come in, sit down, put some goggles on and a headpiece, and then they get to take a ride on the Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. Next up was a chance for everyone to sing that famous jingle in unison. In preparation, sheet music was handed out. And according to Max Jacobson, supposedly lots of dedicated training. You got to practice. You got to get lock yourself in a in a dark room for um, for three weeks, um, and just practice the song over and over in your head and out loud. That's how, that's how you get it down perfect. With a countdown for Mr. Dietz, the singing began. And with that, perhaps those same dogs were joining in. For the voice of Alexandria, I'm Joe Kurkowski.